Hi, I'm Richard Robinson. Um, I'm in the Material Science Department at Cornell University. We've been making a lot of nanoparticles, and uh, the whole idea behind nanoparticles is as you get smaller and smaller, you can change the properties of the materials. Uh, and because of that, we're able to harness all of these properties for interesting applications, uh, such as solar or transistors, um, or in our lab, what we're working with is catalysis for fuel cells and batteries. And so we had to go against what everybody else had been doing and come up with a way to put these nanoparticles on the surface uh, and still make them electrically conductive and still make them stick very strongly. People have been doing something for a while for a reason. Um, you should be able to deviate from that. Um, so in my lab, uh, we've had, I've only been here five years and we've had 32 or 33 undergraduate researchers. Uh, undergraduates bring to uh, our laboratory a lot of new ideas, a lot of creative energy. Students come to me all the time and bring me uh, discoveries that I hadn't even told them to work on. We have a lot of these different subjects, a lot of these interdisciplinary uh, interactions, a lot of these centers that bring people together. Um, and so you, you talk to biologists, you talk to chemists, and all of a sudden you come up with something that you hadn't thought about before, that you hadn't thought would possibly exist within your own lab. I think material science and engineering at Cornell allows me to combine all of these pieces together uh, to, to really put together an interesting research program uh, for my students uh, and for myself as well.